So you finally did it, you took the plunge, and you started your online journey. Hopefully you're using Kajabi, and if you are, making digital products is a breeze. We're going to be looking specifically on how to create your first digital product. So let's not waste any time and dive right in. Just a reminder to check out ReviewOnlineCourse.com. It's a collection of all my software reviews, the pros, the cons of each platform to help you decide which one's right for you. And just remember, if you decide to use any of my links to trial platform like Kajabi, Thinkific, or Teachable, and so on, you get a free pair of Apple AirPods as my way of saying thank you. Check the description box below for more details. Anyways, back to the video. All right, and here we are on the back end of Kajabi. You can see there are five tabs over here on the left-hand side, website, products, sales, marketing, people. And since we are creating our first digital product inside Kajabi, you can probably guess that we're heading over to the product tab. So when you click this products tab, there's an all products option. Now here are all the products that I have for this particular online membership I have. So there's a lot here. Um, I have a lot because Kajabi gives you an opportunity to create a lot. If you head over here to new product, click this button, and then you have all these options, right? Look, so you can see right off the bat, and this always changes right now, there are seven that are being offered. I'm sure that there's gonna be more at a later date. There's a blank offer. It means you can customize it to whatever you want. That may not be the best if you're getting started for the very first time. A mini course is a great way to start. It's asking about the, the, the why they need the product, the how they can keep it, and the what, you know, what it is and why they need it. You know, all these like all these quick questions to answer to build a mini course really easily. You've got the online course. Now, what's that? That's like, I would say that's a uh, that's an adult mini course, right? So you get your mini course. It's just kind of a couple little small videos to get people started, to kind of whet their appetite. That product, a mini course, could probably be given away as a like a ethical bribe for an opt-in. An online course is pretty much more of a, bet, a bread and butter product. You're going to be charging money for this product. So I could see you wanting to actually start a mini course and then giving them the option at a later date to buy the online course, which has a more extensive layout of information. You can see there's an opportunity to drip a course out. What does that mean? Well, dripping a course um, is an ability to, and I don't want to say the word slow play, it kind of sounds like that, but an ability to, to uh, put the content out in a continuous way without creating overwhelm for your students. So if you just let someone into your membership site and it's let's say a, a library or a vault of just videos, it's hard to know where to go. But if you create a, a strategy and you drip those videos out, it does one thing. It, well, the main thing it does is it actually doesn't create overwhelm, <laughs> you know, because you actually have a structure. And the other thing it does is it actually keeps them interested in what you're offering. So the truth of the matter is if you just give them everything right up front, a lot of people aren't going to stay. If it's dripped out over the course of, let's just say, six weeks, maybe even two months, four months, whatever it is, you have an ability to build a longer relationship with it. I, I would say that the trip course is almost similar to like a a a college course, right? You go there, you don't get all the information at once. You follow a syllabus and you go around, you go down that syllabus throughout the year. So a membership site, if we move on from that, that is a site that we can create a continuous revenue. You hear about this passive income. You can offer your membership site. It could be a continuity site that you add to, but the membership site is really strictly for members kind of creating this like eliteness. Hey, my members get to see behind the scene access and this is the membership site. So that's a cool way to really get um, a centralized hub for your members to return and consume that content because they feel a little special. They're not just a, a customer, they're actual a member of your site. So, and you can kind of add content continuously. That might actually go on forever. You might actually never stop making content for your membership site. There's a coaching program that Kajabi offers. It automatically generates a 12-week coaching program that lays out exactly the steps that you would take if you were gonna coach someone on a 12-week program. And that's customizable. You can make it 10 or make it like 
14 if you wanted to, but Kajabi already automatically already builds you a 12 week program right off the bat. And the seventh thing, and a lot of people don't think this is a product, but it very much is, and I think we're gonna see more community products as online courses and evergreen content becomes a little played out. I mean, videos are everywhere across the social media landscape. So now people really want to be more invested in a community. And that's what Kajabi is offering here. They're offering you an opportunity to be a part of a community and people will pay for that. They'll pay $15 a month or $100 a year to be a part of your specific community within your niche to get the information that they most desire. So you've got these seven particular products. Let's take a look at the mini course because that's most likely your first place that you're going to start. You click this get started button. We can just keep the title mini course. We can just say test and we don't need a thumbnail. We can fill this in later. We're going to hit submit. Kajabi's going to build our product and there's going to all these like bills and whistles and they're going to, you know, kind of tell you there's finishing touches going on and voila, there it is done. So let's take a look. We just created this. So there are no members in this, but right off the bat, you can see they give you a bird's eye view of what you can expect, how many offers are included, how many members are in the mini course. Getting hit this more tab, you can manage the comments straight from here if anyone's commenting in your mini course. Announcements, letting people know that you have maybe an online course that's coming out soon. You can view the progress. You can go in there and you can actually see what members watched what videos. So you can really have a good idea about what content is really resonating with your customers. So, and then you can clone it which is really, really cool. You don't have to like rebuild the whole thing. Once you put all this work into it and you just want to tweak a couple things, you can clone the actual digital product that is the mini course. If you look right here, here is your layout. Welcome aboard. Lesson one, it's the what. Lesson two is the why. Lesson three is the how. This is a really simple way to kind of tell people what you're offering, why it's important to them and how they can actually use it and use those benefits to kind of make their life better. So, and then there's this see what happens next, which is cool. That's almost like a call to action to hey, say, hey, listen, this is the steps that I need you to take moving forward if you want to be a part of what we're building here. So this is a great product to actually create for free in the very beginning to get people interested in what you are talking about. So right here, if I was going to click on lesson one, let's just say, here is the back end blueprint of what that lesson will look like. Now, Kajabi has taken the liberty of filling out the majority of this for you. Now, you probably need to change this verbiage a little bit, but Kajabi actually has verbiage in there right off the bat. So now instead of just kind of coming off off the top of your head and trying to be a copywriter, you've got something already here to kind of tweak and to change and kind of like mold into your own version. It makes it so much easier when there's something laid out to tweak than it does just a blank page. So good job. He's so great about putting that in there. Now you can actually add downloads, maybe like a PDF or an ebook that they get, or maybe a workbook that they can follow along with you while they go through your mini course series. You have the ability to actually create all comments and make them visible, hidden or locked. You can actually add automations. That gets a little more complicated. We won't really get into that. There'll be another video. We can add a thumbnail right here. And right here, here's the media. What does media mean? Well, media is the type of content you would like to add to this particular lesson, whether that be a video like this one is, an audio message, maybe an audio file like a podcast is, or an assessment, which is essentially like a quiz. Someone can take a quiz and maybe work through a certification process as you're offering that. This is a great way to test um, your students as they go through your mini series. So right then you've got this awesome opportunity where almost 85% of this thing is done for you. All you gotta add is just a little bit of you in here and it's finished. If I go back to the mini course overview, that's it. We've got the lesson two, lesson three. Let's just say we wanted to add a video to lesson one, a video to lesson two, a video to lesson three. We just changed the verbiage a little bit. And then we have a welcome email and then maybe a conclusionary um, video or email that just basically says, hey, thanks for stopping by. I'd like you to check out our new online course. So here's an opportunity right here at the end 
to offer another digital product to someone who's already gone through your course. And this is why Kajabi is great because all you have to do is come back over here to products and create a new product right up here, the big blue button and create now an online course that you can now offer to your already kind of thirsty for knowledge members. So that's what's really cool. Kajabi gives you these options at this particular point in time, seven particular options to build out digital products that you can sell to your audience, making it very, very seamless. The only thing you have to add is you and your content. I hope that helps you guys on how to create your first digital product with Kajabi. If you have any questions or comments down below, I love answering them. I'll see you guys in the next video.